guys, it's Lexi, and welcome to Grow Together Part 17. So, I've decided I'm going to go to Part 20, and 20 is going to be the last of this. Um, I'm going to record them all at once, so just be aware they're all pre-recorded so that I can just ha have to edit them. But, let's get right into this episode. So, I'm having trying to get her to work on her book. Kiyoshi should be working on the opponents. Everybody else is at school. Um, I'd really like to get some of their teenage aspirations done. He needs to do homework two more times so we can get that done. Um, what does she live fast? Okay, pull three pranks. Okay, I think we can do that. Um, audition passed. Of course it was. So let's see. Uh, Riley, um, her fitness skill is done. Um, she has to do that um, Friday, so it's tomorrow. So, But I'm going to have her work on her guitar skill a little bit more. So go ahead and practice that for a while. Um, she's working on her book. When the kids get home, I'm going to have them work on some of their stuff for a little bit. But I'm just going to have these guys like grind a little bit for a little for a while. Okay, he's going to have to discipline the kids. So we'll see how this works. They are home. Okay, do homework five times. He is tense, but he will do his homework. Um, you, I don't know why your homework keeps going. I wish you guys would stop sitting it on the ground. Go ahead and do that, and then I'm going to have her pull some pranks. Pull pranks three times. Um, so let's prank this toilet. Prank this toilet. Uh, and then let's prank her parents' toilet. See if that will work. I don't know if it has to be at three different houses. Um, but we're going to try that. Get in trouble. She is. She, it did say she was. Uh, that she was rebellious last episode. So, she needs to get in trouble for something. So, I think we'll have her sneak out tomorrow. I think that's what we're going to have to do. Um, and then you can go ahead. Okay, she's pulling the pranks. I want him to take a shower. Um, is it giving her credit? Yes, okay. And then she can go ahead and uh, get some leftovers and... Uh, watch TV for a bit and then after she does that she can sleep you do you not have football today no you don't have football today you do need to practice with the football can you do that alone or do you have to do that with somebody well go ahead and practice football with your dad for a bit did you finish that book I think you did so let's go ahead and publish that um we need to publish 10 more books but i'm gonna green her up riley i forgot you were doing this are you level seven yet you are level nine so i'm gonna have you go ahead and go to sleep um you are doing your homework and then you can go ahead and go to sleep you are, no, go sleep in your own bed, please, and not your father's. Um, you, can it go ahead and go to sleep and get everybody nice and green. Okay, so I haven't done really any of the high school stuff. Um, Laura is at high school. She's a bit hungry, but... It's like school sports day. I want her to like make some friends though. So let's just do like a friendly introduction to like everybody. She's an athlete as well. So I just want her to like, she should know all these people. He should probably, no, it's cheerleading day. Okay. So she should know all these people. Um, I don't really know, like, I took her to the festival, but I don't really know what's happening. <laughs> so.
go. Um, let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction to everybody because I'm assuming they're all cheerleaders that she goes to school with. Let's go ahead and let's do a friendly introduction to her. Okay, just meet everybody, please. And then I'm gonna have you go ahead and um, actions form a group. Uh, hang on, hang on. How do I get you? Okay. Oh, she's doing it too. Okay, hang on. Does she know? I. How do I get her high school? No. Um, doesn't she have like dresser? Doesn't she have like? Here we go. Change into that. Okay. Um, does she know all these people yet? Let's just see. She looks like she's in charge of the cheerleaders. Um, friendly introduction. Trying to get her to meet as many cheerleaders as possible. Friendly introduction. Friendly introduction. Okay, then I'm going to have her form a group. Is everything shut down? No, we're not ready yet. Form a group. Um, and I want the people who are dressed as cheerleaders, which is you two. Okay, do you know him? Uh, friendly introduction. No, I'm trying to, like, get her to meet her teammates. Form cheer routine together. Okay, this is not working. Okay. Alright, let's go home. Alright, let's just go home. Okay, if anybody watched Abandon, this is the house that Riley and Nyla lived in. We are here because it is a tiny lot, and that means that the friendships should work easier. So, we're going to send him a friendly message. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's go to the teen center. Okay. So Axton has met her at the teen center. Um, there's nobody here yet. Well, here's somebody. You're an adult though. Um, so this is a lot built by, um, James Turner. It is a rec center. It's the rock and roll rec center. I put the rock and roll teen center cause I needed a place in the world for teens to go. So, while we are waiting on somebody, I'm going to have her, um, can you not, I thought you could do puzzles here. Do you have to buy a puzzle? I don't know how to do this. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know. Is it a different, is it a different table? Purchase gifts. Toys. Mm, okay. Well, maybe they won't do a puzzle. I thought for sure game. Oh, puzzles. Okay. Well, I haven't done any, uh, a lot of stuff with this pack, I guess. Okay. So choose a puzzle. Let's do a hundred piece puzzle. Um, let's do the, that. Uh, okay. Oh, it's prom time. Travel to prom with Axton. Okay, they are at prom. I thought they had both been asked to prom. Oh boy, what are you guys wearing? Um, let's let's change their outfits. Let's let's give them some prom outfits. Uh, change no. Yeah, you guys don't have formal wear. So we're just going to. Okay, so we got little Alora here. This is what Alora looks like. 
in her prom outfit and then her brother axed it out here i need to get some more men's formal clothing because i just could not find something for him but this is what he's wearing okay so um i'm pretty sure this guy right here asked her out. first of all can't we vote for how do we vote those are speakers. Aren't we supposed to vote for like prom king and queen? This is a good chance to like meet. Why is there a young adult here? Let's meet some people. Um, wait, didn't you? Why do we need to meet Nix? Nixon. Oh, wrong person. Okay, hang on. Sure. Hang on. Where did Nixon go? Oh, he's dead. Okay, I thought he asked us. Okay, we're dancing with this person. Okay, that's fine. Um, uh, hang on. Let's do this and let's dance. Okay, dance with someone. Okay. Slow dance together with this guy. Oh, like you, I'm pretty sure you asked us to the prom. Slow dance with Nixon. Okay, um, how do we vote? Oh, here we go. Vote for prom royalty. I guess we'll vote for our brother. And then Jester will vote for... I like the way she looks. And then he is going to vote for his sister. And then for Jester, we'll vote the same person. Okay, they're both voting. Okay, can I get, use photo? Oh, hey! Uh, photo with, friendly photo with, let's take one with Axton. That'll be cute. No, there's a photo booth. Okay, then, oh, let's uh, take a mischievous photo with Nixon, because I think technically he asked us to prom. Oh my God, wait. Yeah, that's fine. Was I just, hang on. Was I just crowned prom queen? <gasps> Hey! She was crowned Jester. Um, oh my god. I... Oh my god. Hang on. Let's... Oh my god. We need a shot for the... She is prom queen. Look at that. Way to go, Alora. That is so awesome. That is awesome. Okay. So, as prom queen, let's go ahead and uh, let's dance and then let's dance with Nixon. Who, does he have an eye on his forehead? Silver medal, but that's okay. I don't know what that said, but... <laughs> Yes, with friends. We're going to bring Axton. Um, we got to bring... Let's bring Bobby. Cherish Bailey. Dylan Bailey. Where's Nixon? Bring Nixon. He's got like an eyeball up there or something. Bring you. Bring Goopy. Okay, they are at the after party. Um, So, you know what I think I'm going to do? 
I'm going to see if I can take a romantic ride with Nixon. I think we need a first boyfriend. Technically, he asked us to the prom. Yes, they both dance with other people, but that is fine. You're allowed to dance with other people. And neither one of them got jealous. So I think this is going to be her first boyfriend. Not her only boyfriend. Okay. Dust friends. Alora has decided she wants to talk to Nixon about the relationship. And what better way to communicate a serious relationship than through a cheesy plum bite peer attraction? Is that twinkle in Nixon's eye a hint of attraction or irritation from the atmospheric fog being pumped into the room? Does she try out the smolder and attempt to win Nixon over, or does she try and de-escalate the romance? She's going to keep flirting. Um, nothing says I want to be more than friends than being stuck on a ride with someone while you're serenading... While you're serenaded by the smooth sound of Frank the flying womp womp. <laughs> the two flirt the entire ride, keeping with respectful boundaries, but also not backing down. Nothing too exciting happened, but something has sparked with Nixon's heart that could be the perfect opportunity for Laura to purse a relationship. Will they or won't they? Maybe you'll find out in a Cuddle Cart sequel. Gain a romance between the writers. Yes, okay. Where is she and Nixon? Okay. Um, so can I, uh, can I give him a little flirt? Can I flirt with him? Uh, can we give him a little flirt and see what happens? I definitely don't think I want her to like marry her high school boyfriend. Um, I want to leave the opportunity open, but I do want her to have a high school boyfriend. Oh, is he not into it? Oh, wait. I can't tell. He's like aggressively flirting back. Can we take another romantic ride with Nixon? Okay, they're going again. I gotta get axed in a girlfriend, too. Alora has anticipated the cuddle carts to be romantic, but he didn't realize the effect it would have on Nixon. He, I think I need to change her pronouns because she goes by her, she, her, um, with flushed cheeks and a coy smile, Nixon looks like he might want to make, take the next step into a relationship. He closes his eyes and leans towards Alora. Could it be that Nixon is leaning in for a smooch or is he just resting his eyes, a reprieve from all the sights and sounds of the attraction? Alora has to make a choice. Does she commit and uh, meet Nixon halfway or does she pull away and try to de-escalate? Kiss him! Um, Alora leans in closer. Nixon stretches his arms above his head and yawns. He apologizes for falling asleep. Laura can't help but be a little disappointed at the revelation that Nixon just needed more sleep and didn't want to kiss. She offers her shoulder if he wants to take another snooze. He accepts and the two spend pleasant and, and sadly friendly car rides. Oh, is he not into her? Oh, okay. Let's go home, guys. Okay, bring these two home. Um, does she get to keep the crown? Aw, oh, come on. She didn't get to keep the crown. That's crap. Okay. I'm going to put this picture of her and her brother on here. We're going to add a frame. That is adorable. Look at that. Can we, like, sit this on a table? Does it have to sit up there? Hang on. She don't have a table. Okay, we're going to keep it. We'll put it on the wall just so that we'll put it down here. That is adorable. Does he get one? No, just her. Okay, it's fine. So they got to go to prom. They had a good time. Um, I She didn't get to keep her crown. Like, I think you should get a crown that she can, like, set up. But, you know, it's fine. Um, So I think they're both probably... He's actually not tired at all. So I'm going to have him... Uh, watch current channel. She. She is going to go ahead and she's going to get all. Um, she's going to take a shower. She's going to um, grab some leftovers. And then I think she's also going to watch TV. Um, Mom, you should be writing since you're in a good mood. Zoom writing. Okay, or not. I. Where are you going? You're not going to go sleep in her bed. If you are tired, 
then you can sleep in your own bed. Um, she um, is also tired, so she's going to sleep. Uh, Riley needs some attention some attention. She is writing. I click on one computer and then they just go to the computer they want. So he needs to use the bathroom. Take a shower and then he can go ahead and study opponents. We like he's at the top of his career so I don't really know what we're worried about. Um and then Riley's getting greened up. So I think we're gonna end this here. Um, if you guys enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I post more videos. As always, my links are in the description down below. And I'll see you guys next time. If you enjoyed this video, I got another one for you right here.